Hey everyone, here we are continuing again in our series on Luke chapter 5. Today we're going to be looking into Luke 5 verse 4. I've been studying out of the NIV, so read along with you what I mean in Luke 5 4. When he had finished speaking, talking about Jesus, he said to Simon, Put out into deep water and let down the nets for a catch. This is a serious life lesson, I feel. Like, just those words Jesus said, put out in a deep water and let down the nets for a catch. Because you see, in life, th this happens a lot, that you'll only bring in a catch if you go into deep water. It's just like gold going through a fire. Gold will only become perfect and rid of impurities that are just cast aside to make it absolutely perfect if it goes through the fire and the flames, that it is destroyed and ripped of itself so that new gold, new purity, new life can be given unto those who go through into the deep water. If you're going through something, allow God to use that. Allow God to use that to make you into a better person. Allow God to make you a better you. It's plain and simple. When you're going through something hard, hold on to God. Hold on to God. Don't ever let go of God. See, through your circumstances, during it and even after it, because during it you get to be a light to others that you're still trusting in God. And after it, you get to use that as your testimony to shine forth the light of God. If we're going to be talking about boats and stuff as an analogy, you are now a lighthouse. <laughs> that people are going to be drawn to you because they see that you have been through deep water, but you are holding on to Jesus. So you cast out your net for a catch, something is going to come in. We'll be getting later into Luke 5 and you'll find out they did catch stuff. They caught a lot, a lot of fish. So if you're going through deep water, don't worry. Do as Jesus says. Cast the net. You're going to bring something in. Praying for you. Hope you have a great day. Talk to you later.